Yep. Back out. Friday. After work. It's about four o'clock. And I'm making um, I'm making use of the longer nights. Cows. Trail. Birds. Blue sky. And wind. As I'm heading. I don't know where I'm heading really. This is a uh, this is a mystery tour. This mystery trip. I'm just going to see if I can find a spot to pitch on the Northumberland coast. Beautiful Northumberland coast. A bloody wind though. It's, just, it's not coming from the um, sea, so it's not cold. I suppose it's one thing to be grateful for. night like lots of people about here but I'm gonna hope to nick into the dunes I can find a gap in the fence mind this is all fenced off all the way along here wall fenced off should have maybe went that way and then in hmm let's see there's gotta be a gap here there's gotta be I'll make my own flipping gap all right let's see where we end up here Fancy filter in that. A lot of wildlife around here, like birds and that. A lot of bird spotters about. Pretend to be bird spotters. Anyway, it's took us ages to get here. It's all fenced off the beach, but I'm on, I'm towards it. There's the first view of the sea. Nice coastline. You get some massive waves along here when it's high and rough. Oh, it's that claim up there. <laughs> like something good of the army. Whew. Anyway, another bit of explore up here. High tide, seven o'clock. You can see where the tide mark is. I don't know if it's a really high tide, or just a high tide. There is a difference. Let's see what's happening. Right. Just doing a little time lapse of the, the sky. It's not going to be much of a time lapse. It's better when there's uh, big fluffy clouds for time lapses, not these wispy ones. Anyway, just to show you my setup, I'm in the top tonight. Now, the reason I've kept it like that, like low at the ground, is for stealth, you see. Nobody can see because of these grass here. You probably only see that little bit top there, but even then, only for the looking. So I've kept it nice and low. It doesn't look great, but it's stealthy. And it's alright, it's flapping a bit. I'll tighten it down a bit before I can. Um, so basically, that's it in there. Loads of room, like. Ugh, loads of space. This is a. Uh, this is an issued army Gore-Tex bag. I've got my uh, I've got my sleep mat in there and the rab bag. Hot, isn't it? Like, absolutely roasting in here. There's loads of little black flies. But yeah, there's plenty of room. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna pull it out a bit, stretch it out. I've got some uh, I've got some guy lines that I can put on and stretch that out over there. It's flattened it, that'll be annoying. But yeah, I want to keep it low and stealthy, you know. I'm sure nobody can see us up here. I'm seeing that, here's some people coming. A few. It's 
plenty of people about, but uh, the lot will bugger off. It's still only five o'clock. Ten to five. I think we'll be gone by half five, six o'clock maybe. Here's me, so much for it. being stealthy. You never saw me, that bloke never saw me. It's alright, isn't it? It's not the greatest pitch of a top ever, but like I say, what we'll do for now, up here. Nice and hidden. <coughs> oh dear. Let's go here. Only see that tent on the top if you look for it. This is the path. This is the path we're on. Just make out the top. I think it's alright. It's alright there. Get a tent there where I am. It's a big flat bit. I should have brought my little tent. And all the flies and the wind. Oh, I'm not really Just tighten it down a bit. Some beer to get on with. Time lapses, beer. Just chill out by the sea. That's it. Quick overnighter. This camp is stealth, low profile. <laughs> so I've got um, I've got my shuggle. That's for like you know, just for flattening out the sand. It's all right in there though. I found a nice flat bit, but I had that anyway. It's nice and light. No, oh, a few beers. Oh, God, can't reach. Jackhammer, seven point two percent. Brew dog jack on my broken glass. Um, got my fire log. Fire log. I've got some nice birch bark, which I've been keeping for ages. That can look like a bloody. I don't know if take this good spark that. Uh, the fire log there. So what I might do is go down there later, right on the beach, dig a pit, and then have a little fire going. I don't know. I might not like it's. It's red hot, like. Uh oh, here's a police helicopter. Not enough for me. I'm not even going to attempt to try and find him. It's too bright, the sun's too bright. I never thought I'd be seeing that. Anyway, I'm going to pour myself a beer. Been off the beer all week again. Brew dog. I've got my radio. Full signal. I'm a very happy bunny. If anybody asks, yeah, I'll just say, oh, I'm just waiting for the sun to go down so I can take some nice night lapse shots of stars. And you should want me fishing rod. That would be a good uh, cover story, wouldn't it? Bring your fishing rod. It's kind of a night fishing, you know? It's not a tent, it's a beach shelter. That's allowed. Anyway, enough of this beer. <sighs> Bloody loads and loads of little black flies about, like. That's the only problem. Other than that, this is spot on. I've been spotted. Zoom! Uh, tide's coming in now. It's lovely here. There's only them black flies that are the problem. There's millions of them. I'm hoping they're gonna nick off. I'm sure they clock off about six when the sun goes down. <sighs> I'm gonna get my tea on soon. Thank <laughs> you. 
give you some idea of how steep this is. Burn that. Pretty steep. I'll edit that bit out. something about that. Sun's going down over there. That's the west of the Cheviots. Looking over at the Cheviots. Nice and clear. Tide's coming in. Got me fire pit for later. Should I decide to stick the fire log in there? I don't know, I might not. I might not bother. Depends. Depends how I feel. That's uh that's looking like a good night. There's not that many clouds in the sky. So, all being well. Have a good night. That is, I think it's Corkett Island. Corkett Island's right out, right out. See that? It's offshore. Nice, yeah, like, tell you what it is, there's space for a few tents in these dunes. It's nice and some flat ledges. One for the future, think about. Oh, I've got to put that in, look at that. Look at that. The wind's pulling it. It's gonna keep pulling it out, so I'm gonna have to. Uh, I'm gonna have to rethink that. Just to peg it on the inside. Yeah, I'm not too fussed. Not too worried. There's somebody coming along here. Look. There's a few people. Like it's a popular place. Someone comes, a man with purpose. Well, if he's got any sense, he'll drop down off a path because there's plenty of room for everybody here. Anyway, keep an eye on that food and that peg. Why it's like Blackpool Pleasure Beach.
grab my bait. The tide's going back out. Back out. And um, that's about it really. It's just a quick overnight, I like. Just uh, you know, just keep a hand in. Bit of a wrecky. Turns out alright. Got a um, bank holiday weekend coming up, so we're gonna I think Carrie's gonna spend some time together in the garden with the barbecue on, just chilling out. Kinda beat it like a few weeks, so yeah, I'm just gonna relax and switch this wind would do off. The wind is spoiling it, you know. Set up here. It's alright. It's not the best. So nice night. Sun goes down. A lot of people at the Lake District. I don't know if I can be bothered with the Lake District in the Bank Holiday and the crowds. Too busy, like. fire pit there. It's quite deep. There was a bit of grass lying about but I've just chucked it all in. I've pulled it back. I've got the shovel ready in case it gets out of control just to swipe it over. I'll bury that as well. I don't... Fire on the beach is alright. You can bury it in the sand. Just gotta watch that grass doesn't catch on. I'm just chilling out now, like the sun's gone. The sun is down. It'll start getting chilly now. I've got me my warm top gloves. Maybe sleep bag. There's time lapse in that, so if it works I'll put that on. If it's rubbish, I won't bother. Um, there might have been some birds dancing to the Benny Hill theme. I'm not sure. Don't know if I put that on or not. Can't remember. Anyway, put the radio back on and just chill out here by this fire. Just keep an eye on it. Nice and warm, throwing off a lot of heat. That's the Cheviots. Head shop, Cheviot. Nice, eh? Having that little fire there in front of my tent. And that's all the filming I'm going to do tonight. Unless anything major happens, like a submarine. Imagine a big submarine just appears there, it would be great, wouldn't it? Or a whale. Or a shark. There was dolphins um, at Seaton Sluice through the week. Somebody, was, somebody took a photograph of some dolphins at Seaton Sluice which is just down the coast that way not far away from where I live actually no such thing up here though too much blooming pollution right I think that's it for tonight just leave you with this view of Hedgehog and the Cheviot Hedgehog is the pudding basin one on the right
There we go. Morning campers. What are you making up to that? I think I'm in the tropics. Nice. Oh, I'm going to go back to sleep. No sleep last night. Dead uncomfortable. <coughs> Excuse me, that's where I was. It's pitched there. That's where I had my little log burning. It's in here somewhere. Buried. Dug another hole there for some reason, but I never used it. Lovely day. This is the start of the bank holiday, Saturday today. Looking like a scorcher. So for that reason, I'm just staying at home. I can't be bothered with the crowds, like it'll be absolutely chocker over the lakes. <sighs> Sand and everything. Not so sure about using a tarp like for camping on the beach. That was absolutely soaked. I've had to put it in my bag for life. I'm gonna be walking back like bloody maybe carrier bag. <sighs> anyway, here we're going, we're off. I'll just do a last swoop. Pegs, you know. Pegs tend to get buried in the sand. I think I counted them all back in. Yeah. Pretty sure I got them all. Anyway, that was my little pitch last night. Enjoyed it. Made a change from the norm. And I woke up to a lovely sunrise as well. So I'm going to head back now. Should take us about an hour to get home. And then have a nice shower and just chill out, dry me stuff off. I'm gonna have to put this bloody top on the washing line, like soaking. Condensation was terrible. I'll put that down to the temperature change. Right, we're off ski. Curl you. Look at its long beak. Oh, it's hard to keep this thing still. That's the end of that video then. I'll just leave you with the sounds of nature first thing in the morning. <laughs>